More than 16 million men and women served in the United States Armed Forces during World War II. Hundreds of trains moved the troops across the country on their way to and from training camps and deparkation points. When the trains traveling on the Pennsylvania Railroad and the Baltimore and Ohio Nickel Plate Railroads stopped at the Lima Depot, they were met by a group of smiling ladies serving free meals. The American Women's Voluntary Service Canteen opened on Monday, November 2, 1942, and the ladies served their first meal to the soldiers on the Manhattan Liner as it stopped in Lima at 9.17 a.m. A typical meal would include sandwiches wrapped in wax paper and placed in paper bags or baskets with fruit, candy, and homemade cakes, pies, and cookies, along with coffee, milk, orange aid, and water. The stops were brief, only 10 or 15 minutes long, and the soldiers would dash off the trains to the food carts designed and built by the Lima Locomotive Works and Westinghouse Electric, or accept food handed to them through the windows. At its peak, the ladies of the AWVS would meet an amazing 40 trains a day. The canteen was a community effort by people across Northwest Ohio who wanted to help our soldiers. Local farmers donated ham, poultry, eggs, and vegetables. Bakeries provided up to 150 loaves of sliced bread every day. Orchards brought their harvest of cherries, apples, peaches, grapes, and pears. Ladies throughout the region baked pies, cakes, and thousands of cookies. Church kitchens turned out meals. Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts conducted magazine drives for the soldiers, and organizations and schools took up donations for operating costs. From 1942 through 1945, a staggering 2.5 million troops were served, all for free. One of the hundreds of thank you letters received by the volunteers read, this letter is written in appreciation and grateful tribute. To us, Lima, Ohio will always represent American womanhood at its finest and noblest. Though the AWVS disbanded in 1945, volunteers continued to operate the canteen throughout the Korean conflict and the Vietnam War. Of the dozens of canteens that operated across the country, Lima's Servicemen's Free Canteen was the longest continuously operated service canteen in the United States. An estimated 4 million soldiers, sailors, and Marines were served between 1942 and 1970.